Hi. Hello. <laughs> that was pathetic. Okay, that was pathetic. That was pathetic. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Right. You ready? Hi everyone. Hi. Um, what we thought we'd do today is rather than make slime from scratch, we're going to review a couple of slimes that you can buy. Uh, the first one we're going to review is Horrible Science <laughs> Slippery Slime. Um, this one is the one you can get from Hobbycraft. Now Hobbycraft have run out of stock and it's £7 a Hobbycraft, but you can buy the same one from Amazon for £9.49. So we're going to give that one a go. And while I was on Amazon, there was one that looks like that. This one was cheaper, this one was £6.48, and uh, we're going to give this a go as well. Um, we're just going to see what happens and what they're like. So, it's like Christmas. Let's open the boxes. Which I can never do. I don't have nails. It should be fine, just go. Thank you. So, in the horrible science room, oh. You get the glow in the dark slime, you get the fart pot, you get a make your own slime, you get some eyes, and some instructions, which is always good. I don't seem to have eyes in mine. Oh. There you go. Oh, there. I didn't like yeah. stuck on side. There you so, go. Tiny. So, what do you. So there's a massive instruction. Ten pages, apparently. Slime safety rules. Yeah, we'll skip that. Yeah, we already know them. Yeah. It tells you you're going to make a mess. Pour some glow in the star circle. Okay. I'm just going to listen to you. Tomorrow. So which one are you going to do? Well, it looks like you've got the fart pot. You can either do the fart one or the glow in the dark, I think. Should we just open them up and see what happens? We might as well. It's a pop chop. Go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so these are the same, I guess, that are already ready made. Mm -hmm. And then you can make your own. Do you want to? Do you want to find the bit and the thing? Because I'm confused. Because now you've got to make your own slime. So. Oh, this is really sticky. Is it? Look at it. Like, it doesn't stick to your hand. It's oh, it's just like jiggly slime. It is jiggly slime. That's what most slimes like this are. Enough to. I don't know if you can do it with this one, you probably can, but it's just harder. That's really disgusting. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah, this is even more jiggly. It is. I'm sure you managed to do it. Oh, well. So, it's as simple as that. You're going to charge it up under a light, and in the dark, it will glow in the dark. So, if you just I turn it up and down. This. Ew. <laughs> it's just gross. Oh look, <laughs> it just where's the where's the worm? <laughs> just like melts. too jiggly. Okay. Maybe it'll work back with it might work better with this one because it's not really. Why is it really all jiggly? separate? I don't know. Nice. Well, it's got a strange mess in the middle of the pot. I'm guessing that's what makes it glow in the dark and it's separated, but but it is. It's a very jiggly slime. Jiggly. Yeah. And then this is the other one which sounds uh -huh. awful when you do this to it. <laughs> oh, it makes me smile every time. Yep. I'm going to use the fart one then. Let's put the fart one in and see if I can turn that one into a worm. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. So I think I might... Act... No, I don't think it's going to work. It's too sticky. Anyway. So, I'm going to open my gum dark slime. I'm going to shake it though. It's kind of kept the worm shape. 
Yeah, will do, because it's like, I, that one's like way too jiggly. Okay, well the jiggly one doesn't really do the worm. No, this one's I have a little one orange one. worm. We'll stick little orange worm there. No one can see it. We'll stick orange worm there. We keep an eye on us. Now, should we get to making it all the time? So, possibly. Hang on a minute. So just, just keep quiet. How, how good is the fart? Ready? We've got to get it ready. I've only got half a fart. <laughs> <laughs> so. Okay, so you get two moldy made slimes. One's a jiggly one and one's a farty one and one glows in the dark. You can't beat glow in the dark slime though. We've got to find... So we can make our own slime according to this. You open the way for it. So the instructions they say we just need, and it's on the back of the box, we just need newspaper, water, a teaspoon and a finger. Well, we have a teaspoon each and we have fingers now. We don't have something to mix in, do we? Oh, I know it gets to the pot. Oh. Dirt. <laughs> <laughs> so, what I did, what I need to find, water, an old newspaper, a teaspoon. I prepared my slippery slime, I poured the powder into the pot and then added water. I can't even find that. It's there on the bottom of the back. Page six, oh yeah. But it doesn't say how much water. Oh, it says fill in the pot near to the top. Oh, where? Duh. What I did, fill in the pot near to the top. Okay. That's probably how it gets so jiggly. So, I misread it. It does say, fill the pot near to the top. Which I have just realised. Which someone's just realised. Um, I'd like to point out, there are lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of words on this. And it's not instructions, it tells you stories and remarks and everything. So it's not the easiest to find. But I missed it. Oh no. I did miss it. So I filled mine all up to the top and now it's a watery mess. So we're definitely going to have to leave this for five minutes. I can't even stir mine in properly. Oh, oh, it's run out. Just to clarify, what we've done is we filled up the pots just up to nearly the tops. It's like runny purple liquid and we're going to leave it there for five minutes. The glow in the dark one um, has separated a bit and is really jiggly. You're going to say you can't open that. Right <laughs> in my mind. It's like, uh, it's really runny. You can't make the worm on it like it says in, in the adverts and everything. Um, and that separation, it's the same as when we had the magnetic one. That's, it's separated. You've just got to mix it up together. I, the, I, get, I, I bet that's the bit that makes it glow in the dark. Probably is. Like when we had the mag magnetic one with all the iron filings separated from everything and made it a funny colour. I'd mix it all together. You really don't want to touch it. So, let's just mix it together. Oh, no, it's like... Yeah, it is. It is. So, so it comes all separated. <laughs> it's. I don't know. Honestly, I would rather just if it's separated, just leave the bit that's separated with like a bit of the slime, just blows it like this. Quite fun. <laughs> this part of it is. It's fun. It's fun. Honestly, though, I would rather make make homemade slime. Here. Um, but it does glow in the dark. I can't show you. So it's very good jiggly slime. The glow in the dark bit separates. You can mix it up together, but it does look a little bit like... It doesn't look nice. That's the easiest way of explaining it, doesn't it? And Jess even separated hers out, and so she's just got a nice kind of green slime. That that's is. fun to play with. Yeah. The thing is, if you can't make slime, you get a fart pot slime and you get a jiggly slime. 
So, we've talked lots about that. Shall we put these away and shall we see if we can make our own slime? So, now we've got make your own slime. We got this from Amazon. Um, like I said previously, and I've forgotten, it's £6.48, and with this one is you pour the slime base to the reactor in the tub, you mix them together with slick, a slick, it's like a stick, but it's even slicker. You watch the slime form. This is making slime without having to go out to the shops and buy all the ingredients. So, what do we get here? We're box. So, We've got the used reactor, we have the used base, and <laughs> the pot on the picture, <laughs> the pot in real life. Look, I've got giant hands. Giant hands with the little pot. So what we're going to do is, it's like I knew, we've got bigger pots. Apart from them, we can't really form a recipe, so, but I think you don't need it. It's another one with lots of safety rules, lots of instructions. So. The instructions are, open the slime base compound bottle and pour six measures of spoonfuls into a mixing cup. Use a spoon and do three, so, hang on a second. It's six of them and three of them. What you can do is you can do all of that and all of that. So, oh no. So, are you ready? Oh no. <laughs> Look at me. No. <laughs> okay, we'll be doing all of it. Well, I was going to do all of it. I oh, know, I'm so. taking the... And of course it's green, and it's this green. kind of does look like glue, but just really watered down. No, I don't think this is what glue. I think this is something no, else. No, it looks like glue. It's really runny. Yeah. Okay. And then you add this. This reminds us of... Of our videos, everyone just watching us stirring and stirring and stirring and stirring and stirring. It says for 60 seconds. It does actually seem to be working. Look at mine. I did, I did, I only used a tiny bit of mine. Oh, this isn't fair. So you've used half the contacts, or half of whatever. I'm, I'm, I haven't even used half. Wow. So this is another one. You don't follow the instructions. Oh, wow. That's so much better. Is it jiggly? I got running water. I followed the instructions. It said six to three, which I got two ounces to one ounce. So that's your six to three, and I've got running water. Jess completely ignored it. And just, I just added the full bottle of that and two drops of that. And she's got slime. Is it cool? And it's actually clear. It's clear green slime. So. It does work. Just don't follow the instructions. Just don't follow the instructions. I don't know how to follow that one. Yes. Apart from it does not act like the thing describes it. It's not slime as in we'd know it. It's very jiggly slime again. No, I don't know like what... I mean like it says you can stretch and pull it. That's what I mean. It's like jiggly slime. Yeah, and you can't squeeze it. It just it does that. For £6.49? I'd go out, buy some PVA, play £3.50 on some contact solution and raid your mum's cupboard for, a, for the bicarb soda and make it yourself. What do you reckon? Yep, I would do the same. Um, if you're not allowed to, then I would say, which one would you say is better? Well, we can't actually see that yet because we haven't checked them ah, yet. true. We need to check on them first. It looks like it's been doing something. He has his mind. It has done something. 
Yeah. It's just really watery. So what we're going to do is we've got to wait for these to do whatever they can do. Um, currently, it's like one of those yogurt drinks yeah. and nothing's happened as yet and we started this 11 minutes ago and it's going to be five minutes. So what we're going to do is we're going to disappear now and we're going to come back in 10 minutes and see what happens. Well, not really slime, it's more like just goop, but it worked. <laughs> what we've got is our horrible science slime. This is after 10 minutes, is a runny mess. Um, if we just stick with the horrible science slime, there are some good things. We've got our glow in the dark. We've been playing with it for the last 10 minutes and what I've done is, if you mix it all up, it actually ends up being a glow in the dark slime. It Whereas goes I've kept it separate because I really like the feel of it without yeah. it in. <laughs> um, so this is kind of like, it's all jiggly, it does glow in the dark. Annoyingly, we can't test it as in on camera, but we know it does. So we've um, tested it. Yeah, so um, no, it's, it's great in that respect. So glow in the dark slime, works, can't make it into the worm like the advert, but hey, and we've already said the fart slime. Is epic. It's epic. <laughs> and this can keep you going for hours. So with the horrible science, if you can get it from the craft, hobby craft, it's seven pounds. Ah, do you know what? I'd probably say it's worth it. Maybe what I'd say is um, anyone that uploads um, from the hor who's bought the horrible science that actually has done the made their own and it worked, um, go on, put in your comments, tell us, uh, send us, uh, upload some things, show us what you've done um, because we followed the instructions um, and we can't get it to work at all. So, horrible slime, sorry, horrible science slime. If you said it was out of 10, what would you say? An eight. An eight. The two good bits and then the one not so good. So, <laughs> I'm sorry, this is huge. We'll just keep on going for ages. I'd like to point out it is the slime, it's not Jessica. <laughs> uh, should we just keep on going? Anyway, right. I'll put them away and be the adult that I am. So, the make your own slime from Amazon. Six pounds 49, six pounds 48, keep on saying it wrong. Um, we have my version, which is like water. Uh, that was following the instructions. What it was, they had a recipe which was six to three, which is two to one. I did two, I did the one, and it came out like water and didn't do anything. Now Jess completely ignored the instructions and what she did was she did the whole pot and she did... About two drops of that. Yeah, that's two squirts rather than drops, but two squirts. Um, and she's got a really clear, jiggly green... Slime. It's a slime, it's a jelly, it's a jelly, but it's a slime. I suppose it you um, can't say slime because it is slime. But. Yes. Um, but for £6.48, uh, pass. I'll let you decide on that one. While Jess is still playing with her jiggly slime, I thought I'd do a couple of quick shout outs because someone came up with a good idea. Um, but I always feel really guilty that when I do this, other people that I'd love to shout out to don't get their shout outs. So, um, Lorna and Kenzie TV, um, thanks for my comment about the nails on the last one. Um, yeah, they're all off now, they're all clean. Well, well except well. one. Um, well, who was it who came up with an idea? Well, Olivia Sager, thank you. We love making our videos too. Um, and um, Ella Gibson, um, yes, this is your shout out. So hi, say hi to Ella, yes. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> um, otherwise, thank you very much. We've decided to do a giveaway. 
Uh, what we've got is we've got the horrible science. The horrible science slippery slime, where you get the fart pot, the glow in the dark slime, and you can make your own. We're gonna give one of them away, and then to someone else, we will then give away the make your own slime that we got from Amazon. The way I'm gonna do it is really simple. As with everything, please like and subscribe, um, share, you know, the whole idea of this is um, we just love it, and we love your comments as well. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna pick two people randomly, in the next 14 days. I will then message you, um, and then if you send us your details, we will post these out to you, um, as simple as that. Um, enjoy, play. It would also be nice to get feedback from yourself of these ones as well. Um, maybe even upload your own little YouTube as well and show us how you did. That would be absolutely brilliant. Um, so thank you very much and good luck with these. <laughs> Jessica is going to carry on playing with the slime because that's what it's called now. So what we've got is we've got the glow in the dark, we've got the fart slime and the make your own after 20 minutes has turned into a slime of some kind. It's sticky, it sticks to your hands, it is slime, it's like blanc mange. It's like what? Blanc mange? No? Like rice pudding. It's like a rice pudding slime. <laughs> out the rice in it. And it's pink as well, so maybe it's strawberry flavoured. No, don't eat it. So, so we've got the, so Horrible Science does make a slime of kinds, and Jessica thinks to make your own slime, as long as you don't put too much of that, what's it called, oozing factor in it, then it comes out as a really jiggly green slime that Jessica's been playing and playing and playing with ever since she made it. Um, so, what we're gonna do is we're gonna carry on playing and seeing if this slime gets any harder or if it stays as squidgy as it is, because we're running out of time now. So we just wanna say thank you very much. And bye. Bye, thank you, thanks a lot, bye. See ya. <laughs>